Hello, my name is Ron Pilasek. I would like to tell a few words about limitations of the automated uh, XRD uh, analysis tool at uh, science24.com slash XRD. When we process X-ray diffraction data, we send it to our server, which performs some series of automatic analysis. However, in order to perform this analysis, a couple of assumptions may, must, be, must be met. First, we use a specific uh, powder diffraction theory, which I described uh, independently. Second, we assume that wavelength is uh, copper radiation, and this may be changed later. We require that minimum oversampling will be 10%, which means that a part of uh, diffraction uh, spectrum must be empty. And we assume no instrumental broadening, which means that uh, you should provide uh, data with uh, mm, instrumental broadening negligible uh, in comparison to the broadening from the size. Uh, we assume also that uh, the system will process single phase powders, which means that uh, every peak uh, in the diffraction file should look more or less the same. If you have mm, two or more components in the diffraction pattern, this will probably lead to some uh, incorrect results. Um, we, mal, we may uh, provide multiphase uh, uh, ability, ability to process multiphase systems later. Uh, I will show you an example uh, of bad data. This is data which contains mostly amorphous phase. There is no uh, significant amount of uh, crystalline phase. This kind of systems uh, cannot be processed automatically, and therefore uh, we assume that um, input file is uh, mostly um, crystalline phase like this. So we have uh, little, uh, little background, uh, constant background, uh, sharp and uh, well visible diffraction peaks. And the, only, and the lack of uh, significant uh, amorphous space in the system. In this version of demo, uh, just uh, these files uh, can be processed automatically. Thank you.